If you have missed the news, Egan Bernal did not start. Stephen Kreiswijk dislocated his shoulder in a crash. Emmanuel Buchmann is also out, and Primoz Roglic had a crash. Chris Froome is in the peloton, but he got, he got dropped on the previous climb very, very early. Kenny Ellison now goes on the attack. Onto the climb, the main part of it, and Ellison has decided to go. And he's going clear to have a little look at whether this win is possible. 2.12 is the, the gap, so he's got the distance. Ellison looking around to see whether anyone's going to go with him. Behind him is Cam Nakwikowski. Alaphilippe, De La Cruz, Haig is there. Kenny Ellison then looking around. There's one rider going clear from that chasing group. And they're looking to see if it's Alaphilippe, but it isn't. It looks like it's Davi De La Cruz. So can UAE get two stage wins in two days? Ellison behind him, De La Cruz. Two riders coming across, and they are Leonard Kamno, who's been riding a superb race today, and Mikhail Kwiatkowski of Team Ineos. And now Elisond is caught by David De La Cruz. He tries to turn the pressure up a little bit. And we're going to have three riders in the lead now. David De La Cruz, Kenny Elisond, and coming up is uh, Leonard Kamner, who attacks on the left-hand side. Kamner is joined by De La Cruz. We've got four kilometres to go. It's starting to look very possible that this breakaway will go all the way to the finish. They are not closing up. Elisond, having started this attack, is unable to go with the acceleration now. So two riders in the lead. Now Alaphilippe responds. And there is Alaphilippe. He looks now to be ripping his way up the climb. Kamna is on a mission now. Three and a half kilometres to go. A little bit of respite on this climb for him. And now he's going clear and he's opened up daylight between him and the rest of the opposition. 20 seconds now with three kilometers to go. That's to the pursuers, 2.18 to the group of the Mayo Jean. One kilometer to go for our lone leader. If he pulls this off, it's gonna be the biggest win of his career. Horrible little rise up to the finish. It kicks up to 11% for Leonard Kamner. It will feel like an absolute age for him to get there. 500 meters to go, 8% it is at the moment. It feels like you're on the treacle really making your way up here to the top this will be his first world tour victory riding for bora Hansgrohe. he looks around there is no one there he moved to bora from team sunweb at the end of 2019 it's been a shortened season of course for him and everyone else but leonard kamner has come out of lockdown in superb form and he is going to take a win by the looks of things on the runway here at Mejev. Well done to the 23-year-old rider from Bora Hansgrohe. It is victory for Leonard Kamner as he wins here on Mejev's runway. He lost 41 seconds on the run-in. Now we turn our attention to the group behind. Alaphilippe attacks to take third. He's gonna finish on the podium. The panache of the Frenchman shows that the legs are coming round. He's just done this as a test for the tour. Jack Haig, the legs are finished. Ellison tried. Masnada there, 